Hi Libra, welcome to your reading. If you are new here and don't want to miss the daily tarot readings, you can subscribe now by clicking the red button below this video. This is a general love reading, so it may or may not resonate with all of you. At the end of this video, if you are interested, I will also record and extend it to know more specific details on their feelings and intentions for you at this moment. Now let's start with your reading and let's shuffle the deck four times. Let's see what is the overall energy. It is the Queen of Wands. There's lots of passion and attraction here for a person. Or there may be a fire sign, Aries, Leo or Sagittarius, this, that has a strong attraction for you. Now let's see what happened in the past and why it all happened. Then there are possible actions towards you, if any, at the end of this reading. Let's start with the past. What happened? Again, we have Sagittarius here fire sign also air as well but uh, there was uh, the connection had uh, both of you had many differences with each other and it seemed like it needed lots of work in order to harmonize to harmonize all these differences it needed lots of work that was not done and uh, the result was the conclusion that uh, you were not uh, the same type or were not uh, getting along well with each other because problems with communication or uh, different ways of thinking about things or having different perspectives about the future. So something like that. It seems like um, both of you did not have much in common. That's what may have been one of the challenges. Now, one person here was not very honest. It seemed like they avoided you and uh, didn't want to deal with you face to face and talk about what were these challenges and how to solve them. And uh, at the current situation, I think you want to express feelings to this person, Knight of Cups, but uh, you want to be logical now. As an air sign, as you are, you want to look only at the facts and not think with the heart, but with the mind. Let's see what is affecting you in your subconscious. You want some cooperation there. You want some interaction with this person in order to see if it uh, may work again or not. How you view the situation? You feel uh, like it will be stagnant, even for some more time. You don't see, you don't uh, anticipate any progress or movement. And what you want to avoid is uh, being in a connection that makes you feel confused. Or being with a person that is also looking for other partners, that is not solely uh, focused on you. Now, let's see about... Uh, your hope. Your hope is to find a partner that will provide to you commitment and stability long term with or, with or without them. But now you are looking for something serious. Let's see what is happening with them. The Tower card. Three of Swords. Queen of Wands. Page of Wands, at the bottom is Eight of Wands. This person wants to talk to you as soon as possible. They want to restart, but they are immature there. I think uh, there's some immaturity in them as well regarding love. And they feel heartbroken. What happened was not expected for them. It came very quickly. For some, it may have been a third party situation as, as well, but they didn't expect the connection to collapse. Uh, that immediately. Now let's see their possible actions towards you. I think they want to open with the Seven of Wands in the reverse. Let's see more details why the Seven of Wands in the reverse. Eight of Pentacles. 
seven of swords in the reverse at the bottom is five of wands now a connection with this person pro uh, has uh, many challenges as we said before it may lead to conflicts and arguments if uh, those things are not confronted and talked about with clarity and honesty so they are not repeated again now their possible actions towards you is that they want a second chance they are willing to work harder now they want to work harder now in order to see some progress but what i see here is that with the seven of swords in the reverse this person may have cheated or was not honest before they want to come back they may want to apologize but just make sure that the same traits may be repeated again if they are not uh, told and uh, if are if not healthy boundaries are put into place because this person may repeat the same mistakes if, if uh, you just welcome them back and uh, said yes to that restart that they want so that's what I see here I see mostly their intention is to to open up and to ask you for a second chance and, and even to apologize they didn't expect that connection to to break down uh, such fast now I will continue this reading for more details in the extended where I want to see how does your person feel now how do they view you now what are their intentions let's see more details and also the mutual energies and the energies around each one of you if you want to watch the extended of this video you can find it now in the description box below see you the next reading and bye for now